couple of Red Bull cans with uh, magnetism. Even though they're aluminum cans, I'm going to send a high current through a coil of wires which will induce a voltage in the Red Bull can which will make an opposite magnetic field which should crush the can. Uh, what I've got is six uh, high voltage capacitors. We've got a step up transformer out of a microwave oven. I've rectified the voltage so it charges them up to a DC voltage. It's going to be about 3,000 volts DC instantaneously discharged through the two brass doorknobs. I'm going to contact it with a metal hook. Uh, be a loud pop, probably a pretty good spark, and then uh, I'll do it a couple of times and then show you uh, what it does afterwards. But you have to forgive my narration, and all I know is it's dangerous, so be careful. <laughs> and here we go. Meter right now shows almost 3,000 volts. It fits inside, it doesn't touch. Sometimes you see steam. So here we go. There's one, two, three. Whoa, pop the can out. Anyway, that's what it does to a Red Bull can. Uh, you do it to a Coke Zero can, you get something similar to that. What it's doing, it's creating a high current through here, induces a voltage in the can because it's round, and it acts like a coil of wire also. Makes a magnetic field here, which is opposite, so it squeezes the can in. Uh, they call it magnaforming, they do uh, other experiments like that, but I just thought I'd give you an example.